Hi guys, thanks for tuning in today. Um, this is kind of an impromptu video. I wasn't really planning on doing one, but, um, and I look, ugh. Anyways, um, today's my birthday, and, um, I was, I got a bunch of makeup, and I was getting ready to put everything away that I've purchased in my hauls that you've already seen, and, and then stuff that my husband got me yesterday, and, um, I was like, well, I'll show the rest of them what my birthday haul was. And at first I was like, no, I'm not going to do it because, I don't know, I was starting to get to this point where I was feeling almost guilty that I had so much stuff. I don't know if that ever happens to you guys, but it just seems like such an excess sometimes and so decadent. And I feel like, I don't know, kind of guilty about it. And then I was like, well, you know, I like to watch other people's haul videos and stuff like that. So, um... You know, I'm just going to go ahead and, and do a quick one. You can probably hear my cat. He's cranky today. <laughs> um, anyways, yeah, and it's really cloudy and gloomy and rainy out today. So the lighting is crappy. So I figured, well, that's just, it's kind of a haul video anyway. So it's not going to really matter. So I'm just going to show you the stuff that my husband bought me yesterday um, for my birthday. He took me makeup shopping. And um, we'll get started. Um, first, uh, we went to two places. We went to Ulta and we went to Kohl's. And um, when we were at Kohl's, actually, I went there specifically, I'm like trying to get my stuff together here. I went there specifically to get this kit, the Lorac um, Spring Bling Bronze Collection. Um, I really wanted this because last year I got the mint edition collection that they had and it had one of these little bags in it. It was silver and then it had a mint green lining, the one last year. And I use that bag all the time. I use that bag like you wouldn't believe. I use it at work as like a wristlet to carry my phone and my money. And I just was really pleased with it. And I saw this one was like a Kohl's exclusive and it was on sale. I noticed on the Kohl's website for $25, I think in 60 cents. And the normal price on it is 32. So so I wanted um, to go to Kohl's and pick that up. And I was worried they wouldn't have it. And when we walked in, they had a whole bunch of them. So um, I'll show you what it's got in it really quick. I should have probably unboxed it before, before this video. So I wouldn't have to deal with all that awkwardness. But um, so this is the... This is the bag. It's just a little, um, it's not exactly like the one I had last year because the one I had last year had a strap on it, like a, a wristlet strap. It's just a gold sequin bag. It's got the um, zipper tab and um, let's see what color the lining is inside of it. And the lining is gold inside. So not exactly like the one I got last year that had a little pocket on it and like I said, a wristlet strap. But still, this is very, cu very cute. And, um, I don't want to drop it. I don't want any more catastrophes like I had the other day. And then it comes with two eyeshadows, a lip gloss, and a double-ended eyeliner. So I'm actually just going to drop that back down on the floor. So I know the lighting isn't great to do swatches or anything, but um, I'll just show you guys. So this is the, the lip gloss. It's a three... D Luster lip gloss in the color is I can't even read it. I'm so blind by my old age. <laughs> it's a bronze and it has a lot of um has a lot of shimmer in it. Actually, I didn't use it last night, but I did swatch it on my hand. So it's got like a whole bunch of shimmer. Like, I know the lighting is really bad right now, so you probably aren't going to be able to tell, but that's that. And then, um, I really like Lorac lip glosses. I've had quite a few of them and never been disappointed by any of them. And then the eyeliner is a double-ended eyeliner. One side is black and the other side is gold um, shimmer, and it has the tip, like a um, brush tip on it, so I'm not going to open that. And, okay, let's see what else here. The two eyeshadows that came with it, I think, are just called bronzed and gold. And, let me, I know I should have all this stuff opened. But this is a really cute kit. And like I said, today's the 19th. 
it's Wednesday the 19th, um, and it is on sale this week at Kohl's for $25.60, and it's a really cute little kit, and I have to tell you, I love these Lorac eyeshadow singles, they're fabulous, I use them a lot, I have other ones that I've picked up in different kits, and they're just really nice, so this one is just called Bronze, and there's really no point to swatch because the light's so crappy today so gloomy it was yesterday it was really really pretty and and nice and then today crappy and then the other one is called golden and i have another gold eyeshadow from from lorax it's a single it's called gold and it's not exactly this shade but it's really really pretty and i think this one is too so I'm excited to have these. And then Ulta has an exclusive, too. They have a Platinum Bling collection from Lorac. And I was going to get that. And when I went and I looked at it, um, I just changed my mind because it comes with a bag, uh, three eyeshadows, a mascara, and a lip gloss. But the two of the eyeshadows are very similar to ones I already have from Lorac. So I was like, you know what? I'm not going to do that. So, so I ended up passing on that one for a second <laughs> okay and then the bag too I'll put that away all right so then we went over to Ulta and my intention was at Ulta I was going to get the Lorac Pro Palette because I have the $10 off coupon for my birthday and then my mother-in-law gave me some money and um I was going to get you know they had the Lorac Pro Palette in stock at Kohl's, and I was like, no, I'll get it at Ulta because I can use my coupon, plus I can, I'm not just that, that's bugging me, plus um, I can use my coupon, plus I get points, you know, like double points or whatever because it was my birthday month, so I said, oh, I'm going go to go to Ulta and get it, and then we went to Ulta, and of course, out of stock. They were so picked over last night. I don't know if it's because they had the 21 Days of Beauty going on or what, but they were totally picked over. So anyways, I ended up getting some stuff that I totally hadn't planned on, but that I have been wanting. One of the things I got was the Stila in the Light palette. Now, I've wanted this for a really, really, really long time, and I, they'd had it, and I just decided, you know what, I'm going to go for it. So these, it comes with um, 10 shadows, mix of shimmer and matte and then an eyeliner also so these are the shadows they're so pretty i mean i'm sure you've seen them before in other videos but they're just so pretty and i've been so impressed with Stila's eyeshadows in the past um i have a few little palettes by them and i just really really i wanted this for a long time and then the eyeliner that comes with it is um one of their waterproof eyeliners in smudge stick in in black and actually that's the what I have on my eyes today, I did use that palette and I did use their eyeliner. Um, but like I said, the, the, it's so crappy, this crappy, crappy out, you know, and um, no point in swatching anything because, you know, it's so gray. So then um, when we had, when we were at Kohl's, I had smelled the Escada Taj Sunset Perfume. And I was like, oh, that smells really, really, really good. But all they had over there was the large size bottle. I think the three something ounce, it was like $79. And I didn't want it that much because um, I don't really need another giant bottle of perfume. So when we went to Ulta, they had the some, like the, the, all three sizes. So I went ahead and I got my husband said, well, just I'll get it for you. So he got me the um, one ounce and I think it was $45 for the one ounce. That's the packaging. And it smells so good. It smell it's such a summery perfume. And it smells like um, coconuts and pineapple and oranges. It's very citrusy, but at the same time it's um, very coconutty. It's just oh it's so good. I sprayed it on myself last night when we got home. But um this is what the back of the bottle looks like. It's got a little design on it. And then the front just says Escada. Or uh, Taj Sunset Escada and the the bottle kind of looks like a sunset like it goes from you know like golden yellow all the way down to like a deeper orange color but it just smells so good and I looked on the website um for Ulta because I wanted to see how they describe it and they said it's like sandalwood and blood orange and citrus and musk and coconut and it's just it is summer in a bottle, I'm telling you guys. And I'm like, it's not going to take me long to go through this. So I can easily see myself getting another <laughs> another bottle of it before summer's over. Um, so then the other thing I picked up I really hadn't planned on getting 
and it's the Laura Geller La Dolce Vita Decadent Four Piece Color Collection for Fair Skin. Um, I had seen this in the Ulta catalog, but I wasn't really interested in it. I thought it looked pretty, but then I was like thinking, I used to have, I had before in the past, um, used up a whole pan of the, um, Laura Geller Balanced and Brighten Foundation, and I really, really liked it, and I just never bought another one for some reason. So this was in fair, and I decided that I was going to go ahead and get it, because it was the last one in fair, and usually her kits only have, like, medium in it. They never have the colors that, that I need, you know, for myself. So this is what it looked like. You get um, the Balanced and Brighten, you get a blush. And then there's a highlight powder you can use as an eyeshadow or a highlight. There's a lip crayon and then a double-sided brush. I did take it out and I used the um, the Balance and Brighten and Fair this morning and I put it back. But um, And then I used the blush also and I did not use this lip crayon. I didn't even take it out actually so let me see if it's not too hard to get it out of the thing. Let's take a look at that and see. So that's the lip crayon. Very pretty. I don't know what the color is supposed to be. Love Me Do Moisturizing Lip Crayon in Watermelon Cooler. Well, that sounds... Ooh, it smells good. It smells like honey. These are nice. I haven't had any Laura Geller stuff in a really long time. So that's that. Really nice. I'm excited to use it. I like Laura Geller. It's just one of those brands that I never buy, but every time I have purchased it, I'm always satisfied with it, you know, so I'm glad to have that. It's nice. And then um, the last thing was I got my free mascara, my CK1 Happy Birthday Mascara, and I didn't realize what they actually say, Happy Birthday, on the tube or on the packaging. I don't know if that's going to focus in where you can see it or not. Maybe not. Anyways, so this is... um. It says it's a multi-look multi multi -look brush, expands or contracts for on-demand volume length and definition, long-wearing long -wearing, smudge and flake resistant, ophthalmologist tested, twist cap to expand or contract the brush length to create desired lash look. And I have seen um, this brush uh, demoed before, and it kind of goes like up or down. It's kind of weird. I don't, I don't usually go for stuff like that because I think it's kind of gimmicky. But um, right here it shows how you can um, twist the cap, like turn it to make the length of the wand go up or down. And then the front of it just says CK1. I have not used any of the Calvin Klein cosmetics before, so I don't really... I don't really know. The packaging is kind of weird. It looks like a test tube or something. And then I'll show you guys what the wand looks like because I probably will start using this right away. This is, it's just like kind of one of those rubber wands with, um, with like those little bristles, those grabby bristles. I like those. And then I think when you turn the cap, it makes it shorter or longer. Not the bristles, the length of the, the length of the actual wand goes up or down. It's like sealed right now, so I think it's sealed. Yeah, so I can't do that. I'm not going to mess with it, but I'm excited to use this. I like this kind. And I've never used anything from the Calvin Klein Cosmetics before. So that's it. That's the end of my birthday haul. And actually, <laughs> um, I was really, really pleased my husband treated me. You know, he really spoiled me this year. He also took me um, out to eat twice and then um he's taking me on Sunday to a Red Wings game I'm really really excited about that because I've never been to a real live in-person Red Wings game we always watch on TV and I'm a big Red Wings fan he's turned me into one so I'm excited about that and um yeah it's been really nice it's been a nice birthday I'm not I'm not uh depressed at getting older or anything so so yeah, and then I will have um, some Avon products coming up that I hauled um, recently out of Campaign 7. Not a lot. I think I got a couple eyeliners, some eyeshadows, and a facial scrub. But other than that, it, you know, it's not a big haul. And then um, I'll be back with some more Avon videos after that for you. But um, thanks for taking the time to watch. I hope you enjoyed my haul. If you have any experiences with any of these products, just let me know. You know, leave any comments or questions below, and I would be happy to respond when I can. All right, thanks a lot. Have a good one.